So in this episode of Viral Rewind, we're going to look at the Madman DOS virus. Now there's not a whole lot to this virus. When you run Madman, we get the little GOAT file print out and it resides in memory and it'll infect executables.exe files when they're closed. And what I mean by that is, is if there's any program that scans the executables like antivirus software or anything like that, uh, Madman will hook into that and add itself to the end of those files. It will not infect them if you just run the executable. It actually needs another program that interacts with it. So again, like a program that scans it like an antivirus program. But namely, Madman has two notable things about it, aside from this little infection routine. One is what it does with batch files. So I've got a little sample batch file which if it's run all it does is use an echo command to print out that this is a sample batch file now it modifies these batch files if you try to save them so if you work on a batch file and you add commands to it and you save it if madman is loaded into memory it's going to add its own little line to the batch file but we need to try to modify it so I'm going to load up Microsoft works here and I'm also trying something on the camera this time. If you notice, we'll get to it a little bit later. I'm trying manual focus on the camera this time so that it doesn't go in and out when we do reboots and things like that, like it's been doing previously. So then we go into the temp folder, find our sample batch file, go to the end, pretend I was going to make a change to it there. Exit, save changes. Go back to our temp folder. And you notice the batch file now has this I'm watching you added to it. And if we look at what it has done, what Madman did is when we saved that batch file, it added its own echo line that reads I'm watching you. So any kind of batch file that gets saved, it's going to get modified in such a way. Oh. So aside from Madman doing the little batch file modification, the other thing it does is whenever you use the Control-Alt-Delete command, we get these eyes. And well, actually, I guess the camera is picking it up. Let me increase the brightness a little bit here to see if that comes up more. So we get this little text printout after that that says, Nothing can save you here, friend. You're in my world now. And you just press enter and it brings you back to the command prompt. So that's pretty much all there is I have for the Madman DOS virus.